Hello guys and welcome back to another episode of biology and of course today we are going to be discussing taxonomy taxonomy all right and of course uh this video tutorial is brought to you by o3 school jump app it is all you need to succeed in your exam okay so it has for the past question recent even the last year questions on the app of course we have some wonderful features such as the classroom feature where uh, as you try to decipher answer to questions our ai powered tutor will be there well, to assist you to guide you to give you all you need to know about a particular question that you're currently on wonderful what's uh, a feature and of course we have the question search feature where you can search for question by topics we have the utm challenge where you can compete with thousands of other students to, work, to win amazing prizes each week till one week to your exam all right so you, you 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 get to participate in many mock exams before the main jump exam giving you confidence making you because of releasing your answer your your scores per week every week after every challenge you lose your score by by your combination so you're able to see which subjects you are you need to improve upon and which subjects you are doing very well all right wonder feature please go to play store download the app if you need the app uh, on your computer system it's also available just send a message on whatsapp on this number 091 215152 forces all right so just send a message on this number on whatsapp and that is all we'll send you a link to download it and activate the app activation is three thousand errors at the time of shooting this video all right it may increase later so please just send a message on whatsapp on this number that you want to activate also and you'll be attended to very quickly all right now we're talking about what systematics today and uh sorry taxonomy and of course we're going to talk about systematics first so systematics is the scientific study about systematics systematics all right systematics is the scientific study of kinds and diversity of living organisms of kinds kinds and what diversity of living organisms and the relationships what among them all right Systematics is the scientific study of kinds and diversity of living organisms and the what relationship what that exists among what this living organism. So that is what what systematic is all about relationships among them. All right, it talks about what is the study of all kinds and diversity of living organisms and the relationship that exists among what this what living organisms. And systematics um, include both taxonomy. Include both taxonomy and binomial nomenclature. All right. Of course, uh, systematics include both what taxonomy and binomial what nomenclature. The branch of uh, the branch of biology that was that studies the classification of living organisms is called taxonomy. The branch of biology that studies taxonomy. What is the branch of biology that studies the classifications of living organisms? All right, it's what known as what as taxonomy. So taxonomy is the branch of biology that studies the classification of living what organisms. It was developed by a Swedish naturalist, a Swedish naturalist. All right, known as what. Carolus, Carolus Linus. All right, please get the name Carolus Linus. All right, is the what is the man that what that uh, discovered what um, this what system of classification, and of course is referred to as the father of modern taxonomy. Carolus Linus is referred to as what uh, is known as the father as what well, of what modern what taxonomy. All right, so I've said taxonomy is the branch of biology that sort of studies the classification of what of living organisms, the classification of what of living what organisms, and it was developed by a Swedish naturalist known as what Carolus what Linus, and this Carolus Linus is referred to as the father, father, father of modern taxonomy okay now the basic taxonomy the basic taxonomy the basic taxonomy is what is, is classified under what eight different what hierarchies all right the basic taxonomy of living organisms or living things is what classified what, uh, on on eight different what hierarchies each level or each hierarchy is known as an individual taxon all right an individual 
individual tags on all right and we have said here that what that the uh, basic what uh, the basic taxonomy of what of living organisms is what is is, is uh, classified on what eight different hierarchies the basic what taxonomy of living organism is classified on what eight different what hierarchies each hierarchy or each level is known as an individual taxon is known as an individual taxon all right so now living organisms are classified are classified based on what on different what hierarchies and of course they include these hierarchies include one we have a uh, domain all right then we have kingdom all right then we have phylum phylum or division all right we have class we have order we have family then we have a um, genus then we have species all right no these are what these are the classification of what are living or in the basic taxonomy classified what under what eight different what hierarchies these are what the what the hierarchies the domain kingdom phylum or division class order family genus or species all right so without the domain if i'm not talking if, if, if as, um, with the uh, exception of this domain right the kingdom is the most what was inclusive or family but of course the domain is the most inclusive all right so when when you don't see domain kingdom will not be the next okay when you don't see kingdom phylum will be the, the most inclusive family all right when phylum is not there class will be the next so this is from the world from the most inclusive to the world to the least inclusive right from the most inclusive most inclusive right to the world to the least inclusive all right so please take note of that all right this is this classification is from the most inclusive world family to the world to the less inclusive world family now so if domain is not then you now say kingdom is what is the most inclusive world family all right but if domain is there of course domain should work on first then in phylum the kingdom is not there phylum should go next now the system of naming species with two names with two names two names is what known as binomial nomenclature the system of naming species with two names is known as what binomial binomial nomenclature all right the system of naming species with two names is known as what binomial nomenclature okay so for example uh, the first name the first name is known as the genus the first name is known as as genus and the second name is known as the species all right the first name is known as a genus the second name is known as what as a species all right for example uh you have a z maze when you see z maze all right given what a system system of all naming with two names my name with two names z maze all right for example when you have homo sapiens homo sapiens all right for example when we have canis familiaris all right this is this our binomial what nomenclature system of what of naming what living organism with what with two names all right this is called what binomial nomenclature system of naming with two names is called binomial nomenclature all right the first name is usually the what is the, is the genus while the second name is what is the species all right before we end the class we're now going to what see a question from the old three schools was jump up okay this is a past question a 2023 question uh, okay it's a 2022 question 2022 model model 2 question 5 all right it's been displayed on your screen right now they say the system of classification of living things used today is based on that introduced by a swedish naturalist named a carolus linius b carl darwin c jean lamarck d carolus mendel all right of course the uh, correct option there is what is carolus what linus all right and we have seen that what in the episode of what of this class please download your, your app today activate it all right and do not forget to like the video do not forget to subscribe and don't forget to share and i'll see you in the next episode thanks for watching